You're really close to me. I know. Because I missed you. I missed you. We are going to be making waffles. Hey, it's Rhea, and today we're going to be filming something a little bit different. As you can see, we're currently in our kitchen, yep. so that could mean only one thing. We are going to be cooking something. <laughs> <laughs> and we have a secret ingredient, Fruit Loops. So we're going to be making Fruit Loop waffles. Yes. So with a milk glaze instead of syrup. So yes. stay tuned, we're going to show you how to make it. The first step in our instructions are to grind up the Fruit Loops. So my grinder, just put it in a plastic bag and use your fist. That's how we do it here in our kitchen. <laughs> we want ours to be really fruit loopy. Oh! <laughs> For this thing, recipe, it says about two cups. The recipe is always just an estimate. You can add as much as you like. Yeah, it's just not the strict guidelines. It's a suggestion. It's a suggestion. <laughs> You're not, don't even try to make a video. <laughs> Make a wrap. So we're in the kitchen. And we're what are we making? <laughs> we're making. Okay. <gasps> <laughs> Don't use a spoon because you'll bend it. So we grounded up our fruit loops. It looks kind of ratchet, but they taste good. Okay, so now we add one and three quarter cups of all-purpose flour. Snow. No, we don't want snow. We don't need any more snow. Here goes the rest of it. We're just transferring it into this bowl because we have more room. Two tablespoons of cornmeal. We got the Fruit Loops with the blue Fruit Loops. I thought they already came with blue, nope. didn't it? Okay. I'm gonna new thing. See, I don't know these things. One tablespoon of cornmeal. I just wanna make sure. So one tablespoon? Yeah. So about that much sugar? Yeah. Cool. And one tablespoon of baking powder. Oh, I got baking soda. Is that the same thing? No! It's not! <laughs> so since Rhea thought that baking soda was the same thing as baking powder, she got the wrong thing. So mom had to help us. Now we need one tablespoon of baking powder. Powder, so not soda. Next is one fourth teaspoon of salt, but you can just eyeball it. Two okay. eggs? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Oh crap. You want to shut? Shh, nobody saw that. No, I didn't. Most people think that it's best to crack eggs, aka you, on the side of your bowl, but it's actually best to crack it on the counter because you get a better crack in your egg. We're gonna pour in two cups. More. More. Perfect. All right, so that is our two cups of milk. We're gonna go ahead and pour that in. You two tablespoons of melted butter. So yeah. pop that in the microwave for four. And while you're waiting for your butter to melt, you can plug in your little waffle iron so it starts super neat. After. This is the part that if you are a young child who does not know how to use these, or Get somebody like me, parental guidance to help you out with this part. Exactly. We put away the electric mixer because we realized that we didn't read the method properly. What you're supposed to do is uh, beat your eggs first and then mix that in with your dry ingredients instead of put it all together So we messed up a little bit on that, but you know what? It We're improvising. Be. It'll it all goes somewhere. You're all you're just eating it in the end exactly. So it's fine. Fold in the crushed fruit loop bits to our batter yeah. See what it looks. This is what it looks like. Yeah, it's very colorful. It kind of looks Green. It kind of looks like the out the outside of our bowl. That's exactly. kind of what it looks like. You always got to sample halfway through before it's Wait, cooked. where's the... So you're going to spray your pan or your waffle maker pan so it doesn't stick. So she's just pouring the batter in. The key to making waffles is you want to put the majority of the batter in the middle because if you fill it all the way to the sides, it will spill out. Yeah. It also depends on the doneness that you like. If you like it really crispy or if you like it a little crispy and soft. Baking is all about preference. What you choose. What exactly. the baker or the cook or the chef decides they want. It looks really fun. They do look fun. Really fun. We're gonna cut one open. If you're not sure if it's cooked or not, you just wanna cut into it and see if it's cooked in the middle. While you're in the middle of making your waffles, we wanna make a milk glaze. Two cups of powdered sugar. Okay. I There's think our it was two cups. Then we're going to add four tablespoons of whole milk. How many? Four? Yeah. And then we're gonna put half a teaspoon of vanilla extra. So basically a lid full. So just a lid full. Yeah, you wanna mix this until it's a good consistency. So there we have our glaze, and this, when we're done with our waffles, we're just gonna drizzle it over top, and they'll be good to go. These are kind of fun for if you're celebrating St. Patrick's Day. 
and you want some fun breakfast pancakes. So you can or even you add can green um, food coloring. You can add some green food coloring. We're not going to do that today, but just giving you guys some ideas. Okay, right, so our waffles are finished. We made about 10, I think. Ta-da! And we have our milk glaze. So we have our cereal and our milk. See? Take a little bit of this and drizzle it across. Yeah! And to top it off, nice and friendly. This is what it looks like. This is the final product with the glaze and everything. Ta-da! Being the Canadians that we are, we are gonna eat ours with maple syrup. Mmm. Delicioso. Like mm, they're really good. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. So that is the ending of our little cooking video, and we're gonna put the link below to where we found this recipe, so you guys can check it out and make it for yourself. If you do recreate it, make sure you post a picture on Twitter or Instagram. Tag us in it so we can see it. Go ahead and like this video if you guys like us doing these types of cooking videos, and we might do more of them in the future. Yeah. So we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye. You're gonna be using milk. I don't get how that works. Not Who great. has the baking powder? We're searching for the baking powder. Because apparently you can't use baking soda. <laughs> so we're going to be making waffle fruit loop. Yes. Waffle fruit loops. Fruit loop waffles. <laughs> hate that. No, Short people that. problems. Like the video if you know you have to stand on a chair and get the top. <laughs> to get the top ingredients in the shelves. So, so now. now. So now. So now. So now. Yes. Yes. Gaga. Gaga. Yes. Touch time. She's sleepy, cause what time is it for you? Two in the morning? I'm in I'm in Europe mode still, so I'm like jet lagged. So to me, it's like one in the morning. Or not? Or not? <laughs> Do you believe in love after love? I can feel something inside me saying, I really don't I did think hear, I did. strong enough now. <laughs> Ew! Ooh. Gotta Ew. take a thumb. Hey, turn up. Goodbye! Bye! 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 B